everybody. I want to make a video explanation of the recent uh, post in Facebook which compared two different systems and asked which kind of implant would have more bone loss. So initially we had only clinical pictures available of by Horizons and Straumann and people voted just based on their knowledge and looking at these clinical pictures as you can see them now. So 57% voted that by Horizons or implant without platinum switching would have more bone loss compared to Straumann, which is implant with platinum switching. However, when I released the uh, radiographic images of the same clinical case, you can see them lower. We can observe that we have more bone loss around Straumann implant. And the reason is that uh, probably those who voted for Schrauman did not took into consideration soft tissue thickness. And as you can see it here, around by horizon implant, we have about three millimeters of tissue thickness, while here around Schrauman implant, we have only about two millimeters. So again, this is uh, really showing that biology and implant design is important factors to get zero bone loss uh, stability. Now, another issue I want to comment is, of course, position of the implants, because you can see in by horizon, this implant without platinum switching and no conical connection, that's why it's placed a little bit above the bone, while in Schrauman implant, implant is placed at the level of the bone because it has platinum switching. But generally, at the end of the day, both facts matter and here we see a clear example why we need to take care of biology in order to achieve best result in our treatment.